Hello everyone, this is Aditya back again with another video. In the last video, we have already, uh, we were building this app, this uh, video player app in which uh, we are getting all the uh, videos from our internal storage. In this video, we are going to move forward and uh, we are going to play this video in our app. So to do that, uh, let me make sure that i have installed the uh, package or not so i have already installed this uh, expo av package uh, this is all we need um, let's see it's uh, their docs and uh, we'll try to implement this this a av means uh, audio and video and this single package works for both uh, uh, both thing so um, in uh, so here after installing all this um, uh, if you haven't installed this already just uh, copy this and uh, run it is in your terminal and uh, this will uh, give you uh, install this will get installed and after that uh, you will need to import uh, media um, in the in our video files i'm gonna import um video so this basically needs uh, i guess a uri where it's gonna play in okay, this one so there should be a uh, documentation about video somewhere let's see this uh, this one it is and this is the, the same uh, same package it's just uh, this uh, this documentation is most mostly focused about video and that was uh, related to both of them both of them so here we're gonna copy this one and uh, put it inside our app let's copy this here instead of passing this uh, uri we are gonna uh, it, uh, our own URI that we uh, URI that we are getting from here items. So this will be like uh, item dot uh, URI and oh okay. This should not be video and th these both are conflicting. That's why let's rename this to something else. So okay, hope this let's put it over here, and this uh, might have fixed uh, over so. And uh, let's save this and try to. Okay. So now, if we're gonna click on you any of this video that are present in our uh, in my phone let's see what happens so it works it works with, uh, with sounds as well uh, so bas this basically does is in the last video we have uh, already implemented this uh, that uh, when we're gonna click on this this will go to a different um, screen uh, navigate to different screen uh, and uh, there uh, and uh, this is the video component where we're gonna play our video and uh, here we're gonna control everything we can control everything over here so next thing is uh, in the video uh, component uh, when we play video we don't want this to be in the portrait mode we would prefer to have this in a landscape mode so this is what we are going to do for that uh, we're gonna need to change the orientation of the screen and uh, 
let's see how we're going to do the uh, orientation thing so the uh, let's here's some orientation screen orientation and uh, i guess i had already installed this package or not i'm not so sure of it um, if i haven't uh, we're gonna need to install it for that uh, I'm gonna let's check the, our package.json and uh, okay i haven't installed this orientation package yet so we're gonna need this orientation package and uh, then we gonna implement this so here it is let's copy this one the let's close our server install this This is taking some time. Okay, now this has successfully installed. So now let's uh, run our server again. So now our server has started again. And uh, after this, let's import this one in our video component. Let me copy this and uh, put it over here. And uh, now, uh, let's change this to something else that uh, style C dot uh, absolute field. I guess this would be a full object. Yeah. And uh, after this one, we're gonna need to change the orientation. And for that, uh, here it is. We can use. Uh, this one we can, we can copy this one and uh, try to implement this or uh, let, let me see if there uh, is there any other options available for this I haven't tried this uh, much I have just tried this on, only once and uh, if we are enough to figure out from here then we want to copy this from that code uh, I think uh, I would prefer to do it this way so that uh, I get to mm, learn it okay that's pretty interesting uh, I installed a snip mm, extension called uh, react JS extension or something so that's the reason I'm getting auto, uh, this these snippets like uh, this fact uh, is pretty interesting for me I guess and uh, here we're gonna change screen Let's import you over use effect. And here we're gonna need to change uh, uh, 
we want to change it back to its uh, normal position like uh, when component gets unmounted then it will come to portrait mode again so that's why we're gonna put um, let's see this first and uh, after that we will try to implement this that one as well let me see if it works okay this doesn't work so this one is not changing over here i've already done this uh, in one of uh, it? Uh, so let's get over there and try to get this form Here it is that uh, change orientation. Here we are not supposed to put uh, landscape or whatever we are having here. Screen orientation or it is a lock, and uh, we can just put uh, landscape. Plain, I guess. So, yeah, now it's fixed. Uh, we can just put landscape over here and uh, Let's see if this works. Yeah, so this works. But the only problem is when we get unmounted and uh, we are unable to get back to our normal skin. So, so this is what we are going to fix uh, right now. So that uh, when we unmount this uh, screen uh, we get back to so for that uh, we're going to create uh, another function and uh, change screen to portrait change screen to portrait mode And here it is. And inside the return uh, here, we're gonna put uh, chains screen or it is into portrait. Okay, I think there is a spelling mistake over here. Oh, sorry. So this one is fixed and uh, let's uh, reload our app. Okay, there is definitely some issue. So I'm trying to reload the app and after that hopefully it will be fixed. Yeah, so now I don't know why this is not uh, yeah, so this one is fixed. Now when we try to open a video it gets to landscape mode and uh, when we unmount this this will go to portrait mode so this works and uh, after this uh, the rest is uh, we're gonna add uh, more functions in this like uh, adding uh, mute button play button pause button and all this kind of functionality and uh, this is all we're gonna do in the next video um, so I hope you like the video
and if you like the video consider subscribing and thank you for watching